Good evening. Welcome to the 2013 Superintendent Scholars Award Program. I was, uh, my name is Bob Morrison, Superintendent of Garland ISD. This is actually my first official kind of event with students involved in passing out things. So this is, this is kind of uh, really uh, exciting for me as well. But I will tell you this, they gave me this script because they figured, you know what, he's new. And so um, not to disappoint Phyllis and everyone who gave me the script, right now it says, please smile. Okay. This is our 28th anniversary of this scholarship, uh, I mean this awards ceremony. We're recognizing students in the PSAT that, uh, that scored uh, at the very highest scores and also the Duke Talent Scholarship. And this is a tremendous accomplishment. So for the students who are here, congratulations. Um, we are very proud of you. I'm supposed to ask some people to uh, stand to be recognized, so I'm going to do that at this time. I can follow orders. It says, ask assistant principals, principals, counselors of all the high schools to stand. Would you all please stand in middle school? Thank you for being here. Let's give them a round of applause. It says here to turn page. I'm telling you, I'm pretty good at this. But in all seriousness, we have a lot of individuals in this district that do a lot for the students. And some of them are here tonight. And uh, Dr. Phyllis Parker, Dr. Kimberly Claycamp, Dr. Butch Stone, Dr. Rhonda Davis, Ruby Armstrong, and Christine, they all do a tremendous amount and a lot of different jobs in the district. But a lot of the accomplishments that you see our students um, have here tonight are because of programs that these people are responsible for making sure that are provided for our students. So would the, those individuals that I just mentioned, please stand and uh, thank you very much. They're all over the place. They're waving at you. And outside of the students, probably the most important group, you know, I have a daughter who's graduating this year and parents, it, we all know there's, students cannot be sitting over here if homework and education is not a priority of the people who are sitting right here. Everybody agree with that? So even though they don't want you to ask them how much homework they have or all of those things, their accomplishments are because you made education a priority in your home. So from, from the administration and I know the school board and everyone, thank you parents. Students, give your parents a round of applause because without them, I promise you, you're not there. At this time, it's my pleasure to introduce Linda Griffin, the president of the school board, to give greetings on behalf of the school board. Ms. Griffin. Thank you, Dr. Morrison. No one rises to low expectations. Therefore, in the Garland Independent School District, we have and we set high expectations for our students. 28 years ago, as a district, we decided we must increase the number of merit scholars. Thus, the implementation of the superintendent and Duke Talent Identification Program scholars. Thank you, students. Thank you for your high academic achievements and your honors. They will enable you to, complete, to compete globally. The program you will hear later is available to encourage you, to equip you, and to engage you in becoming a distinguished merit scholar. The challenge will be great, but you are ready. Remember. Success begins with setting goals. So let this program be one of your goals. Again, thank you parents for your support of your student, our students, and your support of this district. So on behalf of the Board of Trustees, congratulations for the beginning of an extraordinary journey. Let me at this time introduce my fellow trustees that sit with me on the greatest board in the state of Texas. 
Mr. Scott Luna, would you stand? Mr. Steve Nag, Dr. Cindy Costaneda, and I am Linda Griffin, and it is now time for Dr. Linda Chance. Thank you, Ms. Griffin, for being here and showing your support. I'm Linda Chance, Deputy Superintendent of Instruction, and I have the privilege of telling you the purpose of the Superintendent's Scholars Program. This program originated in 1985 as a priority with the Board of Trustees, improving the academic achievement of GISD students. 28 years later, this goal still remains our highest priority. There are two groups of students here tonight, seventh graders and high school sophomores. All the seventh graders are here tonight participating in the Duke University Talent Identification Program. Since its inception in 1980, more than two million students have participated in the Duke's TIP program where academically talented seventh graders are identified through test scores. Each of you were invited to take the ACT or SAT college entrance exam as a seventh grader. Not only did you take the challenge, but you scored well enough to earn the title of Duke TIP Scholar. Personally, I hope to see each one of you here again when you are high school sophomores taking your place as a GISD Superintendent Scholar. The sophomores are here tonight because they had the opportunity to take the PSAT, which is the shortened version of the SAT. The simple fact that you are here says that you have done well on this test in fact, you have done so well, we believe you have the potential to score high enough on the PSAT next year to qualify as a commended student, merit semifinalist, or even the coveted merit scholar designation. Achieving one of these honors, you can earn scholarships to many universities in the United States, and you can have a competitive edge in the selective college admissions process. A high score on the PSAT also communicates that you are academically prepared for college. At this time, I would like to ask Rhonda Davis to come up. She is our advanced academic administrator, and she's going to describe the opportunities that we have available for the superintendent scholars. Thank you, Dr. Chance, and thank you, board members, for being here to show your support this evening for our students and Dr. Morrison for, for speaking first. And students, thank you for your attendance tonight. We are excited to honor you this evening and to recognize you for your accomplishments and have great expectations for you as you continue your educational journey. Now for the part I have to read. Good evening, it is my privilege this evening to give you an overview of the program of study for our superintendent scholars and for our Duke TIP scholars this evening. First, our superintendent scholars have the opportunity to attend a three-week summer preparation course where students learn question strategies, how to analyze the questions, and take a full-length practice test. The instructors are specifically trained to teach this course for these students. The superintendent scholars also have the opportunity to return in the fall on Saturdays in, in the month of September to continue their preparation and then sit for the National Merit Qualifying PSAT exam in October. Garland High School is the site for both of these courses, both the summer and the fall. The Duke TIB students are being honored this evening for their performance on the SAT or ACT this past January. They have been recognized as either state or grand in their recognition. They have summer opportunities through Duke University and can choose study programs which are offered in various locations around the nation. If you would like to sign up and pay for the Superintendent Scholar Summer Program, and I know that some of you did that before the program began, after the program is over at the kiosk in the back, you may do that. You can take the form that you received in the mail and go take care of that this evening, or you can mail that in either way that you choose. Right now, I want you to hear from two young ladies who were a part of last year's Superintendent Scholars programs. Both of these young ladies scored at the top of their class at their respective schools, 
and I'm going to introduce them to you and have them say a few words to let you know how the Superintendent Scholar Program has affected their lives. If you would, please welcome first from Garland High School, Demetra Adams. Hi, um, like she said, I'm Demetra Adams and I'm a junior at Garland High School and I participated in the Superintendent Scholar Program last summer and it really held my scores jump like 30 points, which in SAT world, world would be 300 points. And um, it's really worth the money. Like it's, the program isn't that expensive like as far as SAT programs go. And it's actually pretty fun. Like it's, it's not set up specifically like a school course. And so it's um, like very free discussion. And for the students, it won't take up, take up that much of your summer. It's just a couple weeks at the beginning of the summer, and then you have the rest of your summer left. And the teachers are really good. Like they're very clear and precise, and they they help you understand um, better how the test works. And really, for like the SAT and PSAT, the more times you take it, the the better you get because it, it's a it's a skill to learn it. So the more practice you get, like the better your scores are. And I really enjoyed it, actually. And I think it'd be a great opportunity for everyone who would like to participate in it. Thank you. Thank you, Demetra. And now from Rowlett High School, Brianna Blassingame. Hello, my name is Bree, and last year I was awarded the opportunity to be involved in the Superintendent Scholar Program, like many of you have the opportunity to do today. The program's actually pretty fun, the classes are laid back, the teachers are nice, and it doesn't take up that much of your time. You will have a summer, I promise. And for those of you involved in the magnet programs, you will get to see a bunch of your old friends like you're seeing here today. And the truth is, it really does help you. After going through the program, my scores jumped about 35 points. The program also helps motivate you to look into colleges and majors that you'd want to apply to. After going through the program and learning about some of these programs, I plan on majoring in linguistics and interpretation at either Gallaudet University or the National Technical Institute for the Deaf. I plan on becoming a medical interpreter to better help people in hospitals understand what's going on. As many of you know, hospitals can be terrifying places even if you do know what's going on. <laughs> Thank you for letting me speak today, and I hope all of you enjoy the program. Thank you, ladies. And now please help me welcome Dr. Phyllis Parker. Thank you, Rhonda. As she said, my name is Phyllis Parker and I'm the uh, Assistant Superintendent for Curriculum and Instruction and Educational Operations. It is my pleasure and my honor tonight to get to call the names of all of these honored students. Uh, they've worked hard, and this is maybe the beginning, or maybe it's just another uh, evening where they get to be recognized for what they work so hard for. So I am excited about doing this. This is one of the pleasures of my job. And um, I will ask then for Dr. Steen and Dr. Williams to help us get the program going. This is Ashley Acosta. <laughs> Hanan Ahmed. <laughs> Janet Ayedun. Iyad Al Rabat, <laughs> Sophia Alvarez, <laughs> and this is Angelica Armstrong. 
Angelica Armstrong. Maria Ortega. Rachel Bankhead. Carla Bautista. Mitchell Boyd. Michael Buey. Caroline, Caroline Cajas. Christopher Callison. Tyler Carter. Vincent Castro. Crystal Cherez. Ingya Chara. Jonathan Cherry. Stephen Conley. Talisa Coronado. Allison Dennis. Megan Devine. Genevieve Dominguez. Christopher Donaldson. Alyssa Douglas. Michelle Dunlap. Angelia Echeverry. Jordan Uten. Juan de Rios Flores. Lexi Ford. Mark Fredheim. Maxwell Fritz. Ariel Garcia. Jesus Garcia. Viviano Gonzalez. Samson Goriola. Rachel Greer. Jordan Guillory.
Ryan Hanley. Tatiana Hawkins. Colin Hedke. Nicole Johnson. Madeline Keith. Brett Knox. Connor Krakowski. Zara Lolly. Ezekiel Lopez. Alexander Lavrine. Colin Luna. Kelly Lee. Alexis Maldonado. David Marquez. Logan Mars. Jessica Marshall. David Matthews. Nicholas McClendon. Rachel McKenna. Erasmo Menchaca. Trevor Mosty. Kelly Mullins. Fraser Mulugeta. Cheyenne Murray. Benjamin Myatt. Hogan Wynn. Logan Payden. Zachary Patton. Sarah Perkins. Christine Pham. Sandy Fong. Tanner Pratt. Jenna Pruitt. Jared Quintana. Jose Juan Quintana. Yeah. 
Yanit Resu. Chance Reina. Samantha Ritz. Angie Robayo. Cynthia Rojas. <laughs> Rebecca Ruiz. Naomi Samuel. Ricardo Santiago Abruna. <laughs> Amber Shanks. Alexis Simpson. Madison Smith. Luke Stevens. <laughs> Julian Trujillo. <laughs> Jonathan Valenzuela. Very good. Allison Van Allen. Hunter Terrell. Nicholas Vargas. Ilse Villade Villeda Principe. I'm sorry. Tyler Waite. Jason Waits. Christopher Yanez. Magdalena Barroso. Evan Boyer. Justin Cesares. Safwan Chowdhury. Claire Collum. Sebastian Dickinson. Rachel Evans. Daniel Fanning. J. Grie Halva. <laughs> Casey Hebert. <laughs> Alexis Herrera. <laughs> Brianna Hill. Stephanie Akimian. Close. Yeah. Jevin 
James. Kimberly Cop. <laughs> Madison Milner. <laughs> Hillary Wynn. <laughs> Amal Curian. Jason Wynn. Thank you. Lan Wynn. Jonas Nunn. Ismail Perez Romo. Anna Polk Tyler. RJ Tavonian. Tychus Tibbs. Is that okay? Ten. Tron. Roderick Armstrong. Kai Trin. Destiny Ugwa. Timothy Varugis. Karen Wimhoner. Wimhoner. Joseph Zamora. behalf of the district. Thank you for being here. Um, students, congratulations again. I hope everybody has a safe trip home. Thank you.